What is up guys? This is Big Bible Mini Movies. I am Sean Jordan and I have a challenge today. There is an event happening at my church. It is a pumpkin giveaway where we are going to give away 750 pumpkins to our local community. My challenge for the day is I'm going to shoot video so that I can put together a promotional ad for our church to capture that we are a very loving group of people and we love our community around us. Now that is very true, but my challenge is to capture that so others see it in a one minute video. You can tell me at the end of this video if I accomplish that task of showing you that we are a very loving group of people. Now at the same time, I wanna look at what the Bible has to say about showing love, the role love plays in your identity, how love can give you drive moving forward, and just how powerful love is for those around you. That is coming up, stay tuned, let's go. Shooting this footage, I'm reminded of last week's mini-movie on calm happiness. How this character trait should be at the foundation of your personality and identity as a Christian. If you haven't seen that video, you can check it out here. Today, we'll explore how love of people should also be at the foundation of your personality and identity. For Christians, Jesus gives this command to love each other. He proceeds to say that it's by this character trait of love that people will know we are his followers. In the world we live in, where abuses, hatred, and judgment have come under a false banner of Christianity, it is more important than ever that we are ambassadors of Jesus Christ by showing love. And love is a uniquely powerful character trait. For starters, love is greater or stronger than both faith and hope. Think about that. Love reigns over both faith and hope. Expressing love can, in fact, erase many previous sins. But how should we express love? Two of the ways are by number one, offering hospitality, and by number two, serving others. Both of which are being expressed today. Not only is it heartwarming to witness the faces of joy from our community, but also to observe the love expressed from these ambassadors of Christianity as they practice number one, hospitality, and number two, service as disciples of Christ. They are living out this idea. You will know I am a Christian by the love I show you. We should show love for non-Christians because Christ loved and died for them as much as you and I. Void of righteousness or goodness, and even though we were sinners, Christ died for all of us, powerless to receive the gift of heaven without him. We all need his love and his love expressed through Christians. Let this be your fuel for hospitality your drive to serve. So smile at your coworkers. Say hello to your fellow students. Invite others into your home. Give and serve when you can. Let them know you are a Christian by your love. Now stay tuned for the world premiere of The Power of Love and Pumpkins. We are here at Sunset Church of Christ this morning, giving out over 700 pumpkins to our local community. Welcome. Hi, sweaters. I swear they're wrong with pumpkins. It's fun meeting wonderful people. 
We're doing good so far. We don't have enough pumpkins. I, I don't think these will last till two o'clock. We need more pumpkins. Look at the line. I think this is awesome. God is definitely blessing us today. We love doing things like this for our community because we genuinely seek to love our neighbors as Jesus has loved us. If you come out and experience this event with us today, thank you so much. We love you lots. If you're looking for a church home, we'd love for you to become part of our family at Sunset Church of Christ. Drop a comment below or check us out at sunsetchurchofchrist.org.